Yeah, hello, this is Dave from CheapBooks.com. I'm playing World of Tanks. The tank I am playing is the German Panzer Mark VI, or something like I don't know what it's called. It is a uh, SPG unit, and it is German, and it is also Tier Two, And the map is Mines, as you can see. I'm also experiencing heavy lag, so the game might not be as good as one that doesn't have heavy lag. Ah, uh, I miss that guy. One of the things I discovered about SPGs, it can be really effective to hit their engines. Because it makes it, the tanks explode. Got a long reload. It's like 30 second reload time. Thought I had 17 shells. It says 14. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's gonna miss. Uh, he became unspotted, so then the aiming changed, and I missed. I'm sure he's gonna back up to reload. So, hopefully we'll nail him, even though he's only got five hit points left. It's too bad I'm fully aimed, and those guys are completely unspotted. He's aimed right at me, I think. Oh, no, he's not. Goodbye. Oh, I didn't kill him. Oh, somebody did. Okay, so far away. I'm going to definitely go for this guy since he's going to be easy to hit. Oh, what did I do? Oh, I screwed it up. Screwed it up. I wonder where the aim is. It looks like it's... There's something really weird going on. I think that because of the lag, maybe I'm not in the game anymore. Yeah, there's something really weird going on. Connection to the server has been interrupted. That's too bad. Okay, so it looks like I'm no longer in the game. Okay. Yeah, so I was hitting the cease button, but you really want to wait and let it try to connect. There's only a few tanks left. That MS-1 is still there. Let's see if we can get him again. Yeah, this game really didn't work out too well. Missed. Wow, this is really difficult. I only see one guy on the on the map. So my radio's not picking up the signal for some of my other players here. And that guy is apparently still hiding there. Ah, uh, missed. Unfortunately, he did not miss.
I'm going to be pretty useless in this game, so I should probably go cap the enemy. I'm going to go to the enemy's base. Or at least try and pick up their signal range. Oh, this is not good. That T-18 is a pretty strong tank. I'm sure he's a lot more mobile than I am. No idea where my allies are. Ouch! One tank left. I'm going as fast as I can to get there. Wow, this is going to be very interesting. I'm only going to get one shot at that tank. And I have to go to his cap. And I'm sure he's headed towards mine. no idea where he is but he obviously just shot at me I'm sure gonna explode any second now I probably sh well driving in reverse isn't gonna really help I definitely gotta make it to that bush Okay, so, did the best I could. What I should have done was, like I said, turn the tank around so I could hit him in a case like that, but uh, I was going to get to the bush first and then turn around, and he was already there, which means he wasn't at my base. Ah, Still got decent points. 2,700 is pretty good. Let's see if it will purchase me anything. I could have sworn it said I got 2,700. Oh, maybe that was coins. It doesn't say. I thought it was 2,700. There's got to be something wrong. You know what? I don't know. There's got to be something wrong. Because I could have sworn I had 758 before. It's like it gave me nothing. I think that uh, there's something seriously wrong with what happened. I don't think it credit. Oh... I don't think it credited me. Oh, we lost anyway, so it didn't give me the five times. Maybe it did give me a couple of experience. I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to get into another game with this piece of machinery. Here we go.
This time I'm going to destroy five enemy tanks. <clears throat> My whole... The whole entire reason why I'm playing this tank is to get the higher level tanks. I'm not playing it, obviously, because I want to play this tank. Uh, today we have the five times victory. It's the last day that I'm going to get this chance. So I would like to get this, use the five times victory to help me get the, the bison in the west faster. And then ideally play those to get five times victory, which I probably won't be able to do. Let's get this show on the road. I would love to just take a random shot over here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch the map on my side and see where people spread out to. To see if it's worth it to take a random shot, and it looks like it isn't. Ah, too late. Really got to react faster than that. Can't hit these guys. I'm going to reverse back up a little bit. Maybe it'll give me a, a little bit more space to shoot. Let's see if I can hit this T7 car. Got a lot of aiming to do. Curious as to why that tank is just sitting there. Oh, too late. Huh. Can't get him. I couldn't hit him. That like extra sucks. Wasn't loaded. I would have nailed him hard. Huh, we're gonna lose this game, that's sad. See what happens. Two on one, we could win this. But, uh, he, no, 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 it's wrong move. You should have gone around him. Lucky shot. Ooh, nice. Nah, he, wrong move. He should have gone right past him and tried to get around behind him. He's going to get. A lot of tanks after him real fast. No, he doesn't. See, this guy doesn't know how to play. He should have kept on going. Hit him on the side. Kept on going. Hit him in the back. I don't know why he would stand a fight against three tanks right now. He should have ran. You know, th this guy doesn't know how to play. He should have ran because otherwise he's got to fight three tanks. If he ran, he would have had better odds. They would have had to spread out to hunt him down. And now he's got 6% left. Who knows what he's doing. 
Yeah, I know it is funny. Okay, so that didn't work out. We'll get into another game. I got 28 experience, which isn't good enough for anything. Well, what I could do, I suppose I could get one of these better tanks and use some of my free experience. But then you wouldn't see the incredible gameplay. <sighs> I'm going to try again. We'll give it another go. <sighs> I want to get to five times victory. I got a lot of tanks I still have to play today. And the only reason why I'm playing this one right now is because I have a lot of server lag, which was making it difficult to play some of the higher performance tanks. So I'm going to play the SPGs, uh, sit out the server lag a little bit, and then I'll probably get into some of the heavy tanks that are not that important. First thing I'm going to do is find a bush to hide in. I'm thinking over here, not only do you want to find a bush, but being surrounded by a lot of trees is a really good idea. It makes it substantially harder for the enemy to spot you. They, they got to be almost on top of you to see you. So as I'm playing, I might relocate. I might start here and then move to other positions. You can see the, the lag is starting to kick in again. I'm going to take some random shots over here. Make them think they're spotted, right? Okay. He thinks he's safe. You know what? No one's going to go spot him. He's, I can't believe this. But that was beautiful, seeing all those shots go in. They blitzed through in the west. see eight tanks so half my team I can't even see I'm sure he's reloading right now come on ah somebody else killed him I'd probably do a better job spotting. You know what? My allies if they see tanks, I won't be able to find out about it because uh, the radio range isn't powerful enough. It could be that they're the ones with the weak radios, not me. You know, they just disappeared and they didn't die. I don't know who those, who those guys are shooting at. shot.
There's a guy way in the back corner for some reason. Who knows what he's doing there? Okay, enemy SPG. I'm going to hit him. They're all arguing now. Isn't that wonderful? Enemy armor is destroyed. Nice. For some reason, these guys were hiding out in the back. I have no idea what they're doing back there. But they're not helping the team out. I'm probably going to have to go to the enemy cap. That's all I'm good for. things sound like they're exploding. God. Target acquired. We're done for. Everyone get out. So th these teammates are arguing um, about whatever reason, and unfortunately, it's one of the guys. Uh, it's this player over here is one of the guys that's arguing, and for some reason. Um, instead of actually playing the game, he's just arguing with another player. And uh, I guess that other tank was the one that was hiding all the way in the back corner. So that's my team. I, if it were a year and a half ago, I would just tell them, you know, go to D4 and please kill the Tetrarch. God. And the other tank is a tier one tank. Okay. Hopefully somebody will kill somebody. Nice. Huh.
And you wonder how people get five kills. They play like idiots. Now he's finally playing. Well, he did a good job against that tank, obviously. Now he's got to go up against a tier 2 tank. We don't know anything about where that tank is. And I'm sure that... Um, he obviously doesn't know enough. Oh, God. All they're going to do is sit here and argue and argue and argue. Got five minutes left. He's typing while he's driving. Keep on moving. Well, that he shouldn't have done. Turn your armor. <sighs> wow, that guy was a real jerk. I don't care how many kills he's, he's got. You know, he went and he killed some easy tanks. It means nothing. I mean, he played like garbage. If he's such a good, great player, why did he get zero kills at the beginning of the game? Let's see the tech tree here. What can I get? Um, I don't know if it matters if I get the Wesp or the Bison. So I'm probably going to get... The Wesp. It's been decided. And guess what happens? When I sell this tank, and I get the bison, let me go to the tech tree over here, or I get the wasp, I'm going to move my crew in. So I'm going to purchase it without a crew. I'm going to go back to the garage. It should be here. And I'm going to select all of my crew members. 87%. I, oh, wait a second. What was that? Yeah, you want him, probably. Who knows? Maybe I'll try the other one and, and see how they turn out. If you train him, what happens? You can get 50% or 75% or 100%. But if we take this guy and we train him, what do we get? We get 60% or 80%. So I could get this guy. He came from what? Where did he come from? He came from the Martyr. So I'm going to take this guy because uh, I can train him harder. And uh, this guy, we've got, uh, excuse me, we take this one, we could do 50, 75, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that, 50 or 75 if we take this guy, I'm sorry, this one, we can do 80%, so I'm going to pick that. That was the gunner. The driver, I don't care about. So we're going to pick the guy that has uh, the best camo. It says medium tank panther. 
So I'm going to check my medium tanks, make sure that the Panther has a crew, and he does. Current vehicle. This is the driver. The driver, I don't care. He's not going to drive anywhere. The loader, we're going to probably take the uh, martyr guy. Because he will probably load faster. I'm assuming he's going to load faster if I bring him in at 80%. And same with this guy. The Jagdpanzer IV is a tank destroyer, which I guess I don't own. What is a Jagdpanzer IV? It looks like it's that one right there. Which, I don't know, maybe I owned it, maybe I don't. I'm going to not use the Jagdpanzer. I'm going to use this SPG guy. Might be able to use that Jagdpanzer in the future when I buy that tank. I'll already have him. This is a loader, so I'm going to pay. Hopefully he'll load faster. Okay, so I've got all this. Um, we're going to check to see if I can get anything better here. I'm going to get the better engine, get the better radio. Let's check out these guns, 53, 410. Gun's about the same. Rate of fire is the same. Probably doesn't matter. Okay, let's put some camo for seven days. Spending a lot of cash right now. Anything here? No. I'm not going to pay for that. We will repair automatically. We will get these shells. I'm going to put this on silver so I don't accidentally buy any. Put the small repair kit. Put the large repair kit. Unlikely to use any of this stuff. Um, put the... Uh, Automatic fire extinguisher, which I'm sure won't make a difference. Okay, I think he's good to go. Let's see how this bad boy does. What do we need to level up? We need... Oh. It's possible I might level up in a game. I, I think it's highly unlikely, but it's a possibility. So maybe it wasn't such a bad purchase. I think it's unlikely I'll get 5,000. I'll probably get half as much. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is find a bush to hide in. And one of the things you can actually do is you can go in the water over there if you want to. I've, I sat in the water before, depending on which tank I had. I think I'm going to just take this bush right behind me. So I'm just going to reverse my way to that bush right there. Let's go. Hope for the best. And maybe I'll relocate at some point um, to get more coverage. You want to get uh, be in the thick of the forest as much as you can. Let's see what his range is. Range is 853. Obviously, I could do a random shot over here. 20 second reload. I wonder where that landed. If you see the enemy artillery, it should be an easy target. Okay, he's dead. A 
as soon as he stops, I nail him. Or if he does that. Ooh, I hit him. Report Panzer 3A. I wonder why. I'm going to take another shot in the same exact spot, assuming that he's still there. No, I guess not. Ah, I missed him. So the other thing to do is to go on to the base and shoot at the bushes, which is what I'll probably have to do. I didn't aim all the way. Well, somebody killed him. So, if they're smart, they're going to hide in a bush. So I'm going to aim for the bushes. Obviously. Try this one. Oh, there he is. Unfortunately, I can't do anything. I got too many allies in the area. Now I'm dead. Well, I got one hit, I believe. Unfortunately, that T-127 doesn't seem to be a very good player. But at least he got the kill. That's what's important. One of the things I'm going to do is I'm going to go through all of my lower tier tanks and I'm going to equip them, make sure that I've got everything researched and see if I can be a better player in the lower tiers. And one of the things you expect, you're like, oh, I'm a great player, I'm tier 9, if I go back to tier 2, I'm going to beat everybody. It doesn't work out that way. There's a lot of good people in the lower tiers still. So I got 1,000, 1,000 isn't that bad. Not what I wanted. But it's going to make it a lot easier to move up, that's for sure. Okay, so, um... <coughs> I'm not going to get this other gun. And I'm probably not going to get the tracks. Okay, if you have any questions, I think I'm going to call it a, uh, a day in terms of these artillery units. Let's see. Yeah, so that was uh, the WESP and the... Uh, the WESP and the G-Panzer Mark VI.